Good afternoon, everybody. This is Joker Man Electronics. Uh, today we got an FFC4, uh, no, FFB4 black. Alright, as you can see, it's all black and everything like that. Now, somebody did this radio, and uh, I mean, I put this on high over here, um, high power. And let me show you guys what this is doing. I'm going to key the mic. It's not even set up right. I mean, on high, at least, it needs to go about right in here. And then on low, when you put the dial on low, then it's supposed to be down here. There's not, uh, it's all called technicians out there not doing a good job. Now, this thing does about 400 watts, which on the scale and everything like that. We're going to get this going. And... Uh, for the customer I guess uh, he, he wants a line and tune on it so we're gonna do that for him all right this this is a really nice radio so let's see what it does on the output like right like I said I just want to show you what it looks like on my dozy meter it's kind of easy for the other uh, people people who's getting in the hobby that's why I have the dozy meter I have the uh, other meter right here it works when I'm done, I'm gonna show you the the output of the radio. So let's let's go put it on low power, which is low power right here. All right. Okay. I'm gonna come down here. Now we're gonna come over here and uh, see what on uh, low power it's supposed to be. Uh, low power. Uh, see it over here. A little power is about 10 watts, about 9 watts low power, all right, which is okay. I would set it at about 17 on low, that way it sound, then it sounds a lot better. And then on high, it's supposed to be about on high, let's go, on high, he has it set at about 60 on high, which is okay, but you really want to get it about, uh, Oh, let's say about 50 to 55 okay okay because uh, it gives a better modulation swing and it's much louder but you know once I get this done this radio is going to be rocking and rolling okay now let's see what this radio could do all right we're going to be on high right now let's see what it does and I got the voltage let me adjust the voltage is 14.8 let's kind of adjust that a little bit better for you 14.5 okay all right let's see what this does YouTube subscribers thank you for watching the video this is Joker Man Electronics all right hello audio hello I'm seeing about 350 out of it audio audio now the bird is gonna show a little bit different so let's try it on high no that was high excuse me Anyways, when I get done with the video, um, so I'm going to pause the video and I'm going to do some work and see what we can do on this radio. Hold on for a little while and I'll get back with it. All right, YouTube subscribers, we're back. We're going to show you the wattage on the output on AM. Um, so, it's just uh, one other thing I want to see in here. They have the DEIs in this thing. Highly reckon not to put these in, especially when you have an expensive radio like this. I will talk to the customer about changing these out, putting some better ones in there. They work. They only do 400 watts. That's all it does, unless he wants to buy uh, $259 worth of transistors. So, and then he has to pay me for putting it in, and, and uh, plus doing all the radio work. All right, we're gonna go up here. Like I said. The radio is doing a lot more wattage. Um, so let's see what it does. Uh, we are on, let me come back over here. I'll put it on high. We are on PEP mode. Let's see how she does. Audio one, two, three, three, two, one. Sounds not too bad. A little bit of echo in there. Now I'll turn off the echo. 
Okay. Three, three, two, one. Check, check, check. All right, you, YouTube subscribers. Um, it's just a little quick little video of the radio. So, God bless and thank you for watching the videos. This is an FFC4. All right. Bye, bye for now.